I received um, two parcels today. I'm really, really lucky. I received my first parcel was from the lovely Janet, and this parcel I've taken everything out. I did open the card this morning, so I am able to tell you who it's from. Completely forgot who was coming. Um, I had to make things every month, and then I had to forget that I am, I am being made for. So. Um, this was sent by the lovely Tammy, who is Tambara Lillian Crafts. I will drop her YouTube channel in the description bar below. And I think, Tammy, if I'm saying this is wrong, please correct me. But I think this is the first time or second time we've been paired up. Um, we were paired up for the ephemera swap. So the ephemera swap was all about sharing your ephemeras that you've got in your drawers. And things that you put on your projects, things like that. So that, that was the idea of the challenge. So, Tammy's made me a beautiful card. So I haven't opened anything. This is how it came. Um, all I've done is taken it out the uh, parcel bag. So Tammy has made me a gorgeous card. And I love the fact you've got a, like, um, like a gateway. Is it a gateway fold? Or am I thinking of a different card? I might be thinking of a different card, but I love the way you've got it folding in towards the middle. It's absolutely stunning, Tammy. Absolutely gorgeous. You've got a mind map. I've got twinkle, what they call it, sequins <laughs> on my hands from opening Janet's parcel. Anyways, I love it. I love the fact you have to tell me where you got these doilies from because I love it. And I recognise this paper pack. I do recognise that paper pack, but I can't think what it's called. And I don't know. I was having a look at this card earlier. I was like, oh, what a gorgeous card because it is. But when you raise over these, they're raised, but I don't know what they are. I haven't got a clue. And they're not anything like an embellishment. There's something that Tammy's gone over with. You know, like uh, the 3D pearl effects? Almost like that. That's what they were. The little ridges on them. So, I will shall open it up. And it says, Here, dearest Clat, here's our ephemera swab. I hope you enjoy it. We tried to step out of our comfort zone just a little. So, I hope that's okay. Plus, a little something extra. Oh, my love, Tammy Tambara Lillian Crafts. Oh, sweetheart, whatever you've sent me, I will absolutely adore. Um, so I can't wait to open it. So I'm going to open the ephemera uh, pack, because that's what the challenge was. Um, and let's see what we have. So how does... Oh, it opens... Oh, my word! Oh, my word, Tammy. Oh, wow. Oh, sweetheart, this is gorgeous. Tammy's made this out. Have you made this out of paper? It looks as Tammy's made this out of paper. I was just wondering why I'm looking to see if it's made out of one piece, but it's not. It's made out of three separate pieces for three separate pockets. So there's six pockets um, that I can count off. There's one, two, three, four, yeah, five and six at the top. So let's start from the top left and we'll work our way down to the bottom right. Oh my word, Tammy sweetheart. So I have got nothing around me. Um, so I'm just going to pop them on you the minute I have a look at them. So this is what's in the first pocket. So these are like little um, alphabetical cards. Yeah, they're like little alphabetical cards. How cute are these? So you've got like B, bear, um, K's for kangaroo. Oh, look at that with the boxing gloves on. How quirky is that? I love it. And the little kangaroo coming out with the little boxing gloves on. <laughs> I love that. The dancing pig. Oh, my word. And the elephant. That reminds me of Dumbo. Which I really want to go and see that in the cinema. Oh, look at that. Do <laughs> the dog. And he's putting up his own kennel outside. He's giving up on his own. Uh. Oh, my word. Where the heck did you find these? Monkey. Oh, these are so cool. The lion. 
and he's got like something around it I think that's a gun of some sort a whip and a chair these are so cool a frog obviously playing the um uh, it's not called a guitar is it when you've got is it a cha is it a cello is that called a cello it's not called a guitar what's it called no it's not called a clarin is it called a clarinet clarinet i can't remember what they call it when you've got one like that a squirrel oh tammy these are so quick you've got another frog i love them oh wow look at these these owls oh my god they they remind me of um the owls out of well harry's owl i should I say out of harry harry potter that's what that reminds me of that really reminds me of that actually i'm so in love so 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 in love uh, the rabbit picking his own veg up. These are so quirky. The bear. The cow dancing over the moon. The elephant. Squirrel. Dog putting his own kennel up. The rabbit. Dancing pig. Cow. Kangaroo. Frog. Lion. Bear. A monkey. Wow. I've never seen cards like that ever. My word, wonder where I've never seen them like ever, ever, ever seen cards like that. How quirky are they? I love them, absolutely love them. And I've just thought of something, I've just thought of something that I can do with these. Thank you so much, Tammy. Tammy, you'll have to keep an eye on the group because there's something on the group that I'm going to do the, these with. Right, I'm going to pop them back in here and I'm going to put the two owls in which I love. They so remind me of Harry Potter owls. And then in the second pocket we have faces or shall I say people. And there's also something else as well. Bless you, Chris. Bless you, Chris. We have these. Oh, my word. Tammy, these are gorgeous. Just make sure I haven't, I haven't forgotten anything. No. Right, okay. I'll do these first since I got these out. These are gorgeous, Tammy. I love these. A dragonfly. These flowers are absolutely stunning. So there's a pink one, a purple one or a lilac one. Love that, the flesh pink one. A white one. Butterflies in like creams and purples. Pinks and creams. They are gorgeous. Tammy, where do you pick these up? They are stunning. I am so in love with these. A little dragonfly there. And they've got like a gold speckle on them. How cool are they? I'm going to bring you down. Let me bring you down. What are you doing all the way up there? <laughs> Some more dragonflies. These flowers are absolutely gorgeous. I'm so in love with these. They almost remind me of like fairy flowers. Like, like you, that's what they remind me of. I like to really catch it on my table tonight and I, I don't know why I think it's because it's coming into summer so I've got sort of three lights bouncing back from each other beautiful Tammy these are gorgeous and definitely will be used in my projects so I'm going to pop these I love these butterflies and the flowers absolutely stunning Tammy you're going to have to tell me where you got these from so when I use them all, I'll hold them for a bit and then I'll use them. But when I use them all, I can get some more because they are stunning. They Like that especially, because of the colours on it, 
it reminds me of um, unicorn colours. That's what it reminds me of. And they've got like a, um, a silver, not a gold flackle, a silver flackle on them. Absolutely stunning. I am totally, totally in love with them. That goes in there. Right. The other thing that I got out of that pocket was these. So I have, let me just put a white board on because of the light catching tonight. I don't know why, like I say. So I have him. How quirky is he? You can sort of imagine him on like, um, on a, an edge of a card maybe. He'd look really cool on top of an edge of a card or tag. Definitely. Uh, you've got her in her little dress that's showing off. Absolutely gorgeous. I am so in love with these. You've got like, um, this would be like more like a housewife, wouldn't they? In the 1950s, 1940s. I wonder whether these are Tim Holtz. Then you, this would look good on a card because I've really got his hand on top of the tag. So let me try and do it. So you can sort of see where I'm getting at. Because of where he's got his hand, it looks as if he's leaning his hand on top of the card. So I, I'm going to use some of these on top of tags. Like she looks as if she's sitting down. So I could pop her on top of a tag. Go the other side. Just because of the way they are, look. She looks as if she sat on top of the card. A baller oh look, how cute that is. A, ba a really puffy dress and like a, a tutu thing in his hair and ballerina shoes. And because of the way the bottom of the shoes are, Again, if I did like a tag or something and I somehow connected him to the top, it would be like he's ballerina on top of, um, she's ballerina on top of the tag or card, just because of the way they are. Oh, how cool are these? Look at these. Again, because of the way he's sitting down. I mean, you guys will see it more because you've seen it through a camera's lens. See what I mean? Almost looks as if he sat there. Then I have like a real um, smallish picture. Mind you, they're all small, but this ones are smaller than these. Then, from next door to each other. You could sort of, if I did that. Look, see. How cool are they? I love these. I've got nothing like these at all, Tammy. Two sisters or two good friends. Look at that. How cool are they? I'm absolutely in love. Oh my word, look at her. How adorable is she? She reminds me of someone. I don't know who though, but she does remind me of someone. I have got nothing like this, Tammy, whatsoever. And then I've got this one. Now this one, I thought, looks a bit like a gypsy lady. But again, because of the way she's sitting. It's there. So the way she's sitting, I could put her on top of a card. Look how cool and effective they are. Tammy, they are absolutely stunning. Thank you so much, sweetheart. I've got nothing like these whatsoever. Um, I have seen them in like a Tim Holtz collection when I go into Hobbycraft, but never have I picked them up to purchase them. Right, and then we're in the third pocket. Oh my word, what have we got? I'm so excited. 
Right, so I have, I'm going to use the card again. So I have daisies. Now, you'll know me at the moment I'm drying flowers out and working a lot with dried petals. So look at these. They are gorgeous, Tammy. Look at that one. It's like a rose of flowers. Absolutely stunning. Butterflies. All in like different colours and tones. These are like, um, I don't know what way they should be. It's one of those one of those things that you don't know what way you should go so I have that one I have this says spring and Robertson 1843 printers binders and stationers 1880 how cool is that I'm absolutely in love totally and utterly in love with that What else have we got? Um, these. How cool are they? So I can write in there if I wanted to. <clears throat> Excuse me. Then I have another Flutterby. And another one. I love the colours. Now these have got, you know how I said the other ones had um, a silver spackle? These have got like a gold spackle in them. Oh, Tammy, they're gorgeous. Absolutely stunning. There's another one of those, um, um, like a contact card. That's what that reminds me of. What else have we got? one of these how cool are they absolutely gorgeous um, I'm just totally blown I'm just like I've got nothing like these at all nothing like even remotely close and I love them. I love them so much, Tammy. They are gorgeous. Thank you so much for these little daisies. And they are perfect for what I'm doing. Um, because I'm working a lot with flowers at the moment. Um, and yeah, they're just absolutely gorgeous. Thank you so much, sweetheart. So they pop in our third envelope. I love the way she's presented it all to me as well. Because I've never ever made anything like this ever before. Um, so this is inspiration in itself. She just sent me this, you know, and I've been happy with that. So the fourth one. Let me just make sure we've got everything out. The fourth one, yeah, I have. The fourth one. I have no idea what we have in the fourth one. The fourth one we've got, um, this is like an advert, I think it's an advert, no it's like a little mini postcard with two birds on, how beautiful is that, absolutely stunning, and then we have that one, we have a postcard, the light should be a lot better now guys by the way, um, about five minutes ago, I clicked on something and it's made the light contrast a little bit better she should be able to see things a lot clearer that one love these oh she's got that on the back as well she's the uh, what they call these cam photo what they call them photo corners oh Tammy the beautiful and what have we got in here Whatever it is, is in a bag. Oh my, oh my 
word we've got a small cameo and there's like um, a little charm in the, in the shape of a clover I'm not taking it out in case I lose it that's the only reason I'm not taking it out so let me show you what was on top so I have some string on a little peg how adorable is that I have a tiny tiny yet adorable and I think Tammy's made this herself little tassel I have a heart hexagon and sh circle shaped pieces and a cameo and like I say um, a charm and then I have these papers how beautiful are these papers I love the green in them absolutely gorgeous Tammy, these are beautiful. It's almost like a little mini kit she's given me to make like um, tags or a card or something. I love this little mini tassel. Absolutely stunningly gorgeous. Thank you so much, Tammy. And this screen is perfect for one, a project I'm doing and two, a project I'm going to be doing. So you've completely read my mind on um, colours. I just put half the papers back in there. Yeah. That's what's in there. I can't believe you sent me all this. I just, I'm sat here like, oh my word. Then I have, I have this. What is noise? So this is it's called Seven Gypsies. And I'm guessing it's one of those Tim Holtz thing again, isn't it? And I'm guessing that each piece I can cut out separately. So this one says vintage market and then goes on and says something in a completely different language I can't read. That one says made in Taiwan. That one says 2017 gypsies with like um, a barcode and a little numbered code up there. That one says sevengypsies.com. Decorate embellishments, um, something, something, a little picture, sunshine coffee, junk, 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 brick a back, well, reliquas, I think that says, old lantern, acid free adhesive, got the old castles, um, archy textures, arty textures seven gypsy and all like all the little gadgets at the top and then that's the so that's the back i think so i get to cut each piece up thank you so much tammy sweetheart um uh, again i've got nothing like this whatsoever um i'm gonna pop it back in his bag absolutely nothing like this and i love one thing is I love to do is cut out like little bits and make tags and make ephemera pieces, different ephemera pieces. So um, I cannot wait to use that. And when I do, Tammy, um, and when I use anything from this folder, what I'll do is I will um, come on and show a video of it. Um, and not only that, I'll show a video of how I've got Ben, how I've made it um because i think that would be nice because you've sent me a load of like goodies and i even got the little bag you've sent me yet um i think that would be really nice if i did that so i'm now in pocket number five and pocket number five has got oh my word pocket number five has got these in so these are i think tammy's ma again made these herself so they're like foiled images so that's got like all flowers in that's more of um daisies gold it's like a gold um pen or something on on top it's carved into the or was drawn onto the black card daisies and stems i'm just loving these flowers Tammy, you've certainly been watching me to know to send like things I would use, and that one 
It's got a small butterfly on there. I think that's a little butterfly. Tammy, these will definitely be used in my project, sweetheart. I am totally in love with it. Um, and I love the way you've sent it me. Um, because I often think, how do I, like with my flowers you all make, I have got you, um, I put all the flowers in these type of bags, these like, um, see-through bags. And I put all your names with them, so that when I take a flower out, I know who's made what. But with ephemera, because it goes in the same drawer, I sometimes get stuck on who's made what for me and how it's made and what whatever. Um, but with this, it's kept in one folder, and then I'll always know that whatever I take out of here, you've given me, which is a really nice uh, way to do it. And something... Um, I'm definitely going to get inspired by. So, I'm just taking out the last bit to make sure. Oh, there's one. Yeah. And we're on pocket number six. Okay. So, since uh, these are the two big ones, I'm going to do... Oh, three. So, I have this one. And this is a upholsters and cabinet makers. And this is more of a like a receipt of like an old fashioned receipt of what they what they wrote down, how much it cost. The railway approach rail line. Houses completely furbished from sixty pa sixty pounds to any amount. Estimates free. Wow. I could read one toilet set. I can read some of the writing. One toilet set, one tablecloth. Um, oh, I don't know why. Uh, any other say? Does anybody? Uh, can anybody else read that? I can see one butter tray. Uh, Leo waiters. waiters nine something some of them I can read one set table mats that says put in something one toilet set Leo leathers something God if you can read what's on there and it's really hard because of it being so small. Please let me know what you're picking up and whether you can read it and how much you can read it. Like I say, I can see one tablecloth, one toilet set, um, one butter tray. Where do I see it? Leo leathers. I can see it. That can I can see that. Oh, I love it, Tammy. I love that so much. And it's got all the prices and what they would have paid. Then this one is system of marking. So, oh wow. So it's your child is com commended for truants marked. So this is the old fashioned how they would mark them in school. So you've got times, time straight, half days absent, days and absent, effort, deported, health, reading, spelling, composition, Pen, penmanship, arithmetic, geography, nurture study, history, civics, English, music drawing, physics education, health inst instruction, ranking class, average, prom to grade, and over here is effort, neatness, interest, punctuality, conduct, attention, politeness, and then your child's work is on a factory where this mark appears unless there is a quick improvement and cannot be prompted. <laughs> so it says, waste of time, carelessly, copies, not att not attentive, mischievous, annoys others and whispers. And signature of teacher, Mary C. Cook. So that's the numbers that they would have given them. And they had 19 in English, which I don't, I think that's a bit bad because every other mark is like 92, 90, 98. Well, they seem to have liked, they got all B's and C's because they, they September, October, and it goes by November. And then over here, 
They've only had, in March and April, they only had two marks for being neat. And one mark for being con conduct, which was in April. And the only month that, the only thing that they were at all marks on was the interest. <laughs> oh, wow. I love that. I love that so much. Thank you so much, Tammy. And then this one says, the register of A and B class in reading. So that they've got the name of the pupils, um, the days, days of the week, and then there's a bunch of numbers. Also, they would have had five out of five. So one, two, three, four, five. And they mark them one, two, three, four, five, depending on where they were. So depending on whether they've been into class or not. I love these. Absolutely love these. I don't know how I'm going to use these because anything like that really interests me. And then inside that I have another one. This is time return and delay report of engine and train employees. So again there's a bunch of numbers and it says dead heading from da -da 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 account of being something by regular something something or less first west in duty released when the train got released wow tammy where do you find these things because it's things like this i search and search and search for online and i can never ever find things like this ever and i just wondered where you found it a little bingo card love that love that so much I, this, again that's the first one i've got i haven't got anything like that and this is another bingo card but this is the old bingo card what they would have had and that's how they it would have looked isn't that cool again first one i've got would never at, where do you go looking for these things <laughs> and this one's like um I would say it's a dart wheel, but it's not. I don't know what type of game. That must be some sort of a game. Is that a dart wheel? Can anybody help me? Because you've got all the numbers all the way round. You've got 26, say, with 12 would be. 10 with 6 would be. 9 with 9 would be. And 17 with 3 would be. But I don't know. I think that's some sort of game. I might be wrong. And then in the same pocket, we've got military ribbons and straw goods. So it's another um, advert, 105 Market Street, special attention to orders. And then it's a little picture of a house. Love that. And then in that same pocket, which I've been, my eyes have been clapped on this whole time, are these. These are Chinese old coins. I have never ever seen anything like these ever before and um, let's see what if it's got any information on the back so it says ancient cash is the currency using an old industry of China its history should be found out as the least from the from the third dynasty bronze core was used as a currency for a very long period during the goods exchange periods the different value between two exchange goods was discovered so that the more currency was used for adjustment so bronze co, co wire i think that's what it's called was treated as the goods exchange media for it's one of the most common de decorations and it has been circulated for a long time before choo choo did this you see whatever that says so basically that was that is this is what they would use to instead of coins basically and so if they wanted to buy like a banana or something down the road this is what they used to use looks like something out of egypt time because of the square in the center how cool are they i love them tammy again i don't know where you find these things but that it really intrigues me and i am like wowed 
totally and utterly wowed and I don't know how you got that back in but I'll get that back in a bit later on thank you so much for my ephemera pack sweetheart um I'm just overjoyed with that and then I like like I said to you right at the beginning um Tammy sent me a bag so I haven't even got there yet so in this bag um which I might decorate actually up oh my word Tammy right so we have a heart acrylic heart we have oh my god <laughs> oh look at that how cool is that that is an owl but in like a steampunk form and it's got like little cogs on the chest and cogs for the eyes <laughs> that is so cool i love him to pieces i don't like steampunk but i do love him and then time is giving me two of these little metal adjustments uh we've got a little spoon with a little cross like um this is a spoon but it's got the queen's crown and the cross on the top so there's that uh hearts um uh is they called bag clasps i think they call bag clasps a china fan chinese a china fan a Chinese writing but in the shape of a fan how cool are they never seen anything like that ever before uh, a cross uh, oh gorgeous absolutely stunning pearl charm uh, that says believe we have another believe this is like I think that's a little bumblebee bring you down so you can get to see it a bit more um i love that that's like a little rose but it's on a flat back embellishment a tree embellishment oh tammy knows i love my keys how cool is that with all like the cogs oh wow little um pearl embellishment this is another little gold bee or oh, yeah it's a little gold bee bumblebee uh, two of these metal embellishments, which I love, or to alter them. An elephant. Oh, wow. I love elephants. Absolutely love elephants. A scissors. What else have we got? Oh, look. A unicorn moon. Um, a mermaid's tail. Another one of those heart clasps. An owl. Honestly, Tammy, you are like eating my mind at the minute this is I'm trying to work out what that is i'm not sure what that is am i re am i looking at it wrong that's the cog but i'm not sure what that line going straight across is is it a sword maybe um a flower a little oh, unicorn horse and then oh and i've got another one of them um embellishments and then i have two of these so this is heavy metal steampunk collection and that says amazing on it how cool is that that says amazing and then this one is exactly the same steampunk and that one says art tammy you've completely and utterly spoiled me something rotten um i feel totally and utterly spoiled by you totally thank you so much for sending me all these cool and wonderful unique things that i've never seen before ever um i think that's what makes it more interesting the fact i've never seen it before um and yeah i think that's what makes it more interesting the fact i've never seen it before and things like the coins and the I just love I love the way you've given it to me in a nice folder that I know that anything like I say anything like you from that folder I know that it's come from you um and I love all these little gems gems they're just super cool and uh I know how you love steampunk you love working I know how you like vintage but I know you like to do steampunk things um so can really see how these embellishments 
um, how you love to incorporate them into your projects um, because I love them. I absolutely am totally and utterly in love. Thank you all for watching. Please leave a comment below on what you all thought about the interesting things I had in the ephemera pack and all the little little things that I've never seen before. Let me know if you have. Um, and yeah, I'm just like, I'm on cloud nine at the minute. Thank you so much, everybody, for watching. And until my next video, I'll catch up with you all then. Speak soon, ladies. Bye for now. Bye.